What's going on everybody? Welcome back to MF Cooking. Today we're going to be showing you how to make Cajun Dirty Rice. I hope you all enjoy this video. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe and hit that notification bell to stay updated when we post new videos. For this recipe, we're going to need one pound of ground beef, celery, green onion, red bell pepper, green bell pepper, onion, rice, beef broth, and minced garlic. First thing we're going to do is chop our veggies. We want to chop them pretty small because we're going to mix them with our rice and we want them to cook down. Now I'm going to add olive oil to my cast iron skillet and one pound of ground beef. If you have regular beef, you don't want to add olive oil because it's going to make its own grease. Now we're going to take our spatula and chop up our beef. We're going to chop our beef pretty small because we like our ground beef to be all over our rice in proportion. Some people like bigger chunks of ground meat. It's time to season our ground beef. We're gonna use all season, garlic powder, onion powder, cayenne pepper, accent, and parsley. So now we're gonna mix our seasoning and begin to add our veggies. We're gonna add one onion, a half green bell pepper, small slices of red bell pepper, at least two stalks of celery, two stalks of green onions, and two teaspoons of minced garlic. Now we're going to add one and a half cup of rice and we're going to mix it in so the rice can toast a bit and then we're going to add three and a half cups of beef broth. This next step is optional, but you can add a half cap of shrimp and crab barrel to get that Cajun flavor and a bit more spice. Now we're gonna add a few whole bay leaves as well as Creole seasoning. And we're not gonna stir our rice, we're just gonna gently lift it so those seasonings could make scent, but we don't wanna stir it because it'll make our rice mushy. And now we're gonna put our cap over our rice and let it simmer for 25 minutes. After 25 minutes, we can go ahead and lift our lid, and that we have it, Cajun Dirty Rice. And remember
remember, you want to lift your rice gently. You don't want to stir it around because it will become mushy. And then after about 10 minutes of cooling off, it's going to be ready to serve. Once again, I hope you all enjoyed this video. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And hit that notification bell to stay notified when we post new videos. And let us know if you all tried this recipe or any other Cajun recipes. See you all next time.